I definitely do not want to lose improv to owning a business. Without that chance to go to the theater and just explore something very weird or silly, then I will not be able to do this job as well. I just can't be a business owner without being an improviser. And vice versa. What's your name? Oliver. Hmm. Going to Burning Man. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> That's a long way. Yeah. Improv is unscripted theater. My favorite part about doing improv, I guess, is just that I think it has the ability to do everything. You can have a show that is so silly and so absurd, and then you can have a show that's grounded in reality, and you can have everything in between. Improv has helped a lot with helping me stand on my own two feet and not let anyone push me down. Kana came to me because I was working at another CrossFit gym. And it was great, but it was also not my vision. After I left my job, six months later, we opened this gym. Good. Chest still open, Julian. There you go. Under the hip. Pop. Yeah, I think it surprises people where I tell anybody that I'm only 28. I always am like a cart before the horse type of person. Like, I want to do something now. I'm not going to let my age be the thing that holds me back. I feel like I learned a lot of things starting my own business. Like, you are the janitor, and you are the laundry person, um, and you are the person that needs to be here if someone else is sick, and like everything that you would not think of that goes into a business, the business owner does. If I didn't do improv, I don't know if I'd ever have the guts to open up a business. <laughs> I don't think that I'd have the ability to take a risk like that and to hold my own uh, like with other people who you deal with in business. Haven't you ever read that book? No. The Pickup Artist? No. <laughs> when I perform, I feel like kind of like the king of the world because <laughs> I feel like so empowered by the stage. I feel like so happy having this job and I was really unsure when we first started if I would be cut out for doing like 14 hour days and you know seven day weeks but I think it's exactly what I needed. So all the decisions I make I make for myself and I make for directly affecting the way that the business runs and everything we do here I'm invested in. The benefit of doing both improv and uh, my job at the same time is that I actually feel like my day is broken up into different types of fulfillment versus doing work and then just going home and recovering from work. I do my job, I leave, and I go actively participate in something else, which is what I need personally to feel really strong and healthy and to feel refueled at the end of the day. So that the next morning I'm like, I'm going to work again, it's going to be great. And that night I can think, I'm going to the theater, this is going to be great. How much can you lift? I can back squat 230 pounds and deadlift 340 pounds and clean and jerk 177 pounds. <laughs> Sounds pretty good. <laughs>